everybody welcome to my hobby home my name is Kathy um, you can see right here what I'm doing I'm doing an unboxing today this is my little surprise I was telling you about this is an instant pot Rio it's the uh, wide plus version it's a seven and a half quart I mean seven and a half let me make sure what it is seven and a half quarts um, I have never seen one of these. I looked for reviews on YouTube. I could not find anything on them other than what Instant Pot put out. I will say, I have never had an Instant Pot. I have had a Ninja Foodie, but I've never had an Instant Pot. So, let's get into this. It. I have not opened it. The uh, Of course, the packaging came undone. When I was trying to bring it in the house because this tape is not gorilla tape thank goodness because I'd never get into it okay let's see discover amazing well let's see what is so amazing here I like I said I've never had one so I'm so excited about this peace of mind with an instant instanthome.com Okay, it's just a little card that I guess gives you their, it gives you their um, web address, which is instanthome.com. Then we have a welcome, join the community. This is my registration card. Okay, then we have a Chardonnay chicken and a honey barbecue ribs. Then we have a Get Started Instant Pot Rio Plus Wide Multi Cooker User Manual. Okay, this tells me how to do everything. Um, and here's an Instant Pot recipe book. Okay, so we know our all of our paperwork we have here. I think we should just get into it and start pulling everything out. I see one thing here that I am going to have to do. And that is, I'm going to have to uh, put the rubber ring on it, which is, is fine with me. Okay, let's see how they have this thing. Back. Ooh. Well, that shows you how they have it packaged. They have a lot of packaging in here. Okay, I see my cord. Let's see. Oh, that's heavy. Which I'm sure, of course, it is. But um, I'm going to lay it on its front there where you can see it. Uh, let me just read some of the things it does here. I know it says it on the side. It's a nine-in-one cooking functions. Pressure cook, slow cook, saute, steam, warm, rice, yogurt, sous vide, and cake. So I'm excited about the sous vide function because that may, I'm gonna turn this over here so it, I can sit it down, make it easier here to get it out of the package. I have a little kitty cat that's very interested. Look, Oscar. There's a box. Okay, let's see what we have. Oh, this is so interesting. I've seen the sous vides, I mean the um, instant pots that are tall like a crock pot. And this one is short and squatty. It is wide. I do like that. Now, this will replace my sous vide machine. So, that's a bonus. I'm going to read some of the... Does this just come... Okay, this comes straight off. Lay it right there. We have a basket on the inside. I'm going to take everything out of the bags so I can wash it 
and we will be doing some test cooking in this thing pretty quick not tonight not tonight no okay so this is your your pan okay and most of the stuff that it does it's it has on oh this is almost exactly like the rack in the ninja foodie because i have one of those okay let's see we're going to take all this tape off it has a whisper quiet uh steam release I'm not going to put the uh, gasket in it yet until I've washed it. But let's see. I just want to see how it, it may not close properly without the gasket. There we go. Oh, it does. Oh, love that. Okay, let me get the box because, you know, of course, the boxes always tell you the good stuff. You know that's the selling stuff okay it's shorter and wider for easier access and better visibility save time and money up to 70 percent faster cooking and 60 percent savings in energy the wide sauteing area perfect for a five pound chicken five to six pieces of chicken a nine inch cake and so much more well, that's interesting. Uh, it has the Whisper Quiet Steam Release Only Pressure Cooker with OK to Open Lid Indicator on the message display. That will be nice. Although I, on mine, on my um, my foodie, my Ninja foodie, if the button is up, you know you can't open it. But hey this i may need this though i mean you know they dummy proof it i can use it then um overheat protection and so much more it has smart 25 preset cooking recipes it has an iq algorithm to auto adjust cooking based on food and recipe rice pasta soup sterilized chicken beef cake egg sous vide and more wow dishwasher safe multi-cooker lid i don't know if my ninja foodie is dishwasher safe it may be the the lid in the bowl maybe but i don't know i don't ever risk that uh, dishwasher safe stainless steel inner pot so the inner pot is stainless steel it is not aluminum it is stainless steel it's not coated uh, a large message display i need that y'all i mean me and my glasses sometimes i don't have my glasses on when i i'm cooking nine and one cooking functions i already gave you those i'm interested in trying the yogurt on this i've never made yogurt and i've seen a lot of people online making yogurt um that should be really interesting because, you know, I'm not supposed to have it, I don't think. I shouldn't have anything with sugar in it because I am a recently one to two year diagnosed diabetic. But we're fixing that. Um, so I'm really not supposed to have sugar. I'm supposed to have it in moderation. So, but I say 35% larger searing surface cooks more faster. It has a guided assistant step-by-step -step display guides cooking oh so it tells you everything to do whisper quiet steam release i already told you that worry free safety features that's the okay to open lid message now my box is in not such good shape okay so i think i've already gone over everything that's on the box sorry about that just had to drop it so let's pull this around and look at this i hope you can see that steam yogurt sous vide slow cooker i like the you know this i think these are all kind of ma probably made about the same way you've got your lock your unlock 
You've got your stain, stain release, pressure cook, rice, cake, and saute. I really, okay, I'm, I know a lot of people, um, I'm going to take my glasses off because they are glaring, and I'm going to have to squat just a little bit. Um, I know a lot of people like multi-cookers, and they end up having... 10 pieces of equipment in their kitchen that does the same thing. My goal with this is to, um, I have two or three slow cookers. I know I have two crock pots. Um, my goal is to get rid of one of the crock pots, to get rid of the sous vide, and to get rid of the ninja foodie. I think. And it may get rid of something else. I don't know. I have too many things in my kitchen. Just too many. Um, I actually just, whoops, right behind you there, have, I'm sorry, I need to throw that paper away. Because if I don't, it'll end up on the floor and I'll forget it's there. And I, I can't always see all that stuff on the floor because it may fall under my island. Um, but, like, I have my Ninja Grill back here behind you. I have a pressure canner behind you. Now, one of the Instant Pots does have a canning setting on it, but through all of the research that I have done, um, I really don't trust it. I really do not trust it to do canning, and that's okay because I have a um, All-American stovetop canner I have an electric canner, I have an electric water bath, I mean, I have an electric pressure canner, I have an electric water bath canner, I have a steam canner, I've got plenty of canners. Um, so that's, that's not going to be an issue, and I don't have to use my everyday kitchen appliances, and yet to me, this is a kitchen appliance, just like my microwave, I use my microwave every day. Um, I don't have to use my everyday kitchen appliance for food preservation. Now, the good thing that I do like on this, I don't know if this is on my foodie or not, but this one has a rice cooker. I have a microwave rice cooker. I'd like to get rid of those because I actually have a set. It's a, um, I think it's Pampered Chef. It's a Pampered Chef set. I would like to get rid of those. I don't need all that extra things. Even though there may come a time that I cook rice in this and I may be cooking a gumbo or something in this, but I can cook gumbo on the stove and put it over in the crock pot and keep it warm. Um, but yeah, so, but guys, hey, I love this. If you have one, down in the comments, please tell me what you think about it. If you like this type of video, excuse me. If you like this type of video, if you like unboxing videos, um, give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and leave a comment. Definitely, if you want to see new content as I upload it, click on that notification bell, and every time I upload a new video, you'll receive a notification that there's content out there. And um, as always, until I see you again, have a very blessed day. Thank you guys. Goodbye.